Hello Beth, it is Monday, May 13th, and I apologize for the state of my hair because I haven't had time to shower in like two days. As you realize, this is Monday and not Friday, and so I'm late. Let me explain. Friday, I wake up. Jake and I go to an art museum because we made a deal that if I took him to go look at art and he would look at art, then I would play video games with him because he was complaining about how I don't like to play video games and that makes him sad. So we made a deal that he would look at art and I would play video games. So we went to look at art Friday morning and then after we looked at art we went roller skating because roller skating, roller blading, we have blades. They're blades and they cut through the sidewalk. That's not what they do. Um, because we've been going roller blading because it's nice outside and exercise. And it's hard. Look what I did to my leg! Stopping on a rollerblades is a hard thing to do. And then after we went rollerblading, I went to work. And then after I went to work, we went out and like hung out with some friends. And just like got some drinks and stuff. And then that was all of Friday. So like every moment of Friday was full of those things. And then Saturday happened. And on Saturday, I got up and I went to an art gallery where I have art hanging up and hung out with some artists and talked about art for like two or three hours and then after that I came home and purchased some art supplies and then as soon as I was done purchasing art supplies I turned around and went back to another art gallery that was like a block away from the other one I had just been at and went to another art show and then I came back home and did laundry and then that was Saturday and then yesterday was Sunday, and on Sunday I woke up, and I went to work. And then after I went to work, Jake and I went to church, and it took a long time to get to church because the whole interstate is closed. So traffic is a nightmare right now. And then after we went to church, I finally came home and we played video games like I promised like three days ago. I'm not very good at it. In other news, Stormageddon is officially a year old now. Happy birthday, Stormageddon! Hear your whiskers in my mouth. I don't remember if his birthday is May 5th or May 10th, but either way, we're past his birthday now, so he's a year old. Happy birthday! Since Stormageddon had his birthday this week, I got him a new birthday toy. You want to see? I've also been working on some art for Marty, which involves carving a linoleum block, and I got this nice gouge in my finger. I don't know if you can see that because my camera sucks at focusing, but it's like there's a hole right there. It's like a mouth in my thumb. I should draw like a face on it. Blah. Some other good news, you may or may not have heard from the parental units, but I am going to be starting working at CVS full-time instead of just part-time, which means that I can finally quit working at the gas station, which means I will only have one job at last. <laughs> Two jobs sucks. And they're also supposedly planning on training me to be a shift leader, which means I get a little bit of a raise, so... Since yesterday was Mother's Day, we were selling flowers at CVS, 
but we'd had them for a while so they were starting to die so we kind of just like started giving them away to get rid of them and these are ones that we were going to throw away so I dug them out of the trash and took them home and some of them are definitely a little bit crispy around the edges not gonna lie they're not by any means perfect flowers but they're prettier than any flowers I have in my apartment because I have no flowers in my apartment until now so I gave myself a dozen roses for Mother's Day. Except I only actually made it home with 11. I don't know what happened to the 12th one. It's gone. Go whoop your tummy. Make your tummy whoop. No, you don't want to don't want the tummy whoop. Okay. Well, anyway, Jake and I are going to go skating in about an hour, so I'm going to wrap this up and put it away and put it on the interwebs. And then after we go skating, I'm going to go to work at SA for my penultimate shift at the gas station. I just wanted to use the word penultimate. The FTBA.